So you have successfully assigned your online assessment in EDOC Trainer to your students, and maybe you either need to change the test window or a student was absent and you need to give that student the opportunity to take this exam. Well, Rick Bray here with Broomtail Gabosis, and let's look at how to do that. The first part is going to look exactly like how you assigned it to your students. We'll go into our assessments tab, we'll find the assessment, I'm just gonna pick this one randomly here, uh, and we'll assign it to your course and class. But here's where the difference comes in. I'm just gonna randomly pick, uh, well, this class. Uh, and this class, uh, instead of assigning it to all of my students, what I might do instead is go into the list and check that one student that it applies to. That's gonna make the next step a little bit easier. If you do select all, not a problem, but it's easiest if you just select that one student in question. Now, what I wanna do just like before is click on the assign button, and here's where the big important piece comes in. If you are reopening the test window, you want to make sure in the top center, the reassign button is yellow. You'll notice if I click a different button, it turns yellow. You want the reassign to be yellow. Why? Well, if you look at the uh, text next to it, reassign says, if a student has already started this test, clicking here will allow him or her to resume. That's also the case if they weren't there, uh, you can adjust the window accordingly. A sign, when I look at that one, that's saying if a student has already uh, started this test clicking here, we'll clear the responses. That means if all of your students are checked and a sign is yellow, it's going to blank out all of their data. You don't wanna do that. Make sure that reassign is checked and then set your test window just like we did before by selecting a date. Uh, let's do a different date, shall we? Uh, selecting a date, a time for it to start, and if necessary, a time for it to end, and then hit proceed. That's it, that's all you have to do to change the test window for students or to uh, assign the test to a single student in the event that they missed your test administration date. Uh, but there you go, the big key thing up at the top to have reassign be yellow to make sure that you don't clear out the data for all your other students. So there you go, uh, that's that one. If you have any questions on this or anything else EdTech related, by all means, please feel free to email me at rbray at btboces.org. You're welcome to subscribe to this channel to get updates and notifications when new videos are posted. And as always, thank you for watching.